Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have got the video everyone has been asking for and it is my handbag storage. You can see in behind me, I have one section of, of my shelving unit here, but I have several more things on this side. So I'm excited to share it with you. So come on, let me take you on a tour of how I went from keeping all of my bags and goodies in their dust bags and uh, putting them in a new shelving unit and uh, my popcorn buckets and a bunch of other beautiful goodies also. So let's get started. Today I have a highly requested video. Everybody wants to know how I store my handbags, my popcorn buckets, and this is the video that is going to show you exactly what I've done. Um, I had been storing my bags in just their dust bags and just had my popcorn buckets kind of just stuck over in the corner. But I finally put some organization to everything and I want to share it with you, okay? I'm going to start over here on this end. Um, as you can see, over here in this uh, direction, I have a mini ear holder that my sister Mitzi made for me and um and i have that right beside the storage unit and then um coming on down i have my mini mouse suitcase and so i just thought those were real cute together and then here i want to show you that i have a bookshelf here that is five shelves total and then I have the same mirror image uh, shelf over here on the right. And then in the middle, I have two different units of cubby holes uh, stacked on top of each other. Each unit has six different cubby holes. So I have a total of 12. And you can see I have two extras down there. But let me just start and show you what I've actually done. Okay, so I have here um, one of my Mickey Mouse zippers and green alien popcorn buckets. And then of course a beepity boppity box standing up behind it. Um, on the next shelf down, I've got some of my coach pieces. I've got two coach um, uh, crossbody bags, uh, which are just absolutely beautiful. And I have a black leather um, cosmetic case. And then I have one of the latest Mickey uh, plushes from Shop Disney. It's the uh, all simulated leather. So it just fits in really good here. And then on the next shelf down, I have um, one of my Dooney and Burke's um, handbags from the Epcot's Food and Wine Festival of 2017. It's got figment all over it. I have the matching wallet. And then I have a crossbody in the sketch print from Jenny and Burke. Meetsy gave me that years ago. And then coming down to the next shelf, I have a um, my Dooney and Burke drawstring backpack in the sketch print. It's a nylon bag and such a cute little Dooney and Burke tag on it. And you can see here, I keep my little makeup brush holders on my tassel so they stay nice and uh, together, not frayed. And then I have my first piece of lounge fly for you to see. Um, it's my Minnie Mouse backpack and matching wallet. These were too large to fit in these little cubby holes. So I had to move it over here to a shelf because of the bow actually. And then coming on down, I have my uh, next lounge fly and it is my beautiful Minnie Mouse bag. I love that. And then I thought my little Pluto popcorn bucket was really cute beside of it. And then down here on the very bottom, I have my Star Wars. I've got my Yoda backpack from Loungefly. Um, Miss Princess Minnie sent me that, Kate. I love it so much. And then I have my um, fanny pack, R2-D2 from my Beepity Boppity Box. And then I have my AT-AT popcorn bucket. So, I love that shelf. So, now, here we are in the middle section in between the two um, tall shelves. And I've got my little pin board here 
that I've just started working on. This is going to be all of my Acme Princesses. And all my other pin boards are slap full. So I started a new one for this one. And I've got a lot to do. These are the only ones I have so far. So I'm looking forward to completing these. But my husband Brad is going to hang it up higher on the wall. It won't stay sitting on the shelf. It just hasn't been hung yet. So, uh, but yeah, I love that in between the shelving units. And then here on top, I've got my gorgeous woody showcase piece that sweet Erica sent to me and then I have a nightmare before Christmas piece that I got from a bippity boppity box this is where I can just set some some collectibles and things um, that just don't really go on the shelf that I don't want on the shelf here are my two pin sets from the masquerade um, midnight masquerade set from Shop Disney. I love those. I'm contemplating putting those up somewhere. And then I have my gorgeous set of Lennox Beauty and the Beast. And I cherish this set so much. It's just stunning. So love that. And then um, that's all I kind of have sitting on top right now. But then we go down to our cubby holes. I have my gorgeous um, Loungefly Woody backpack with a matching wallet. These are all mini backpacks. And then I have my Buzz Lightyear. I got that in a bippity boppity box. And then I have my Imagination Pink that I got in a bippity boppity box. So I love those. And then going on down, I have my Stitch um, backpack that Mitzi gave me from Loungefly. And then I have my Imagination Pink, which is stunning. And then I actually have a um, Disney X or Disney X or Coach Disney X uh, piece. It's a, a mini backpack. And then down right below it, I have another Disney X mini backpack um, from Coach. And um, coming over to the side, I have um, the Star Wars. I'm starting my little Star Wars set. This is um, uh, Finn's um, backpack and wallet. And then I have another one over here with a matching wallet. And then the last one I have down here is Ray's. So that's Ray's backpack and wallet. And that's it for the middle section. Okay, here's the last shelving uh, unit that I have in my display. And up top I have a um, bippity boppity box and I have my Cinderella carriage um, the sweet little Disney cupcake mom sent me that and I love it so much and then coming on down I have a beautiful um, one of the prettiest bags that I have and it is my doggy print satchel from Denny and Burke and I love it so much you can see I have the makeup brush covers on the tassels there also. And then here's the blue print in the doggy print. And then I have a little cosmetic case, which was a purchase with a purchase from the Disney store. So love this shelf. I think it's so pretty. And then probably my favorite shelf of all is this one. I know I've been giving you little hints of this one, but this is my bell shelf. And you can see I have my brand new bell um, tote from Dooney and Burke. And then I have Cogsworth here. Cogsworth is a working clock and it does good. Look at this thing just swings back and forth all the time. And then, of course, I have Lumiere all lit up and shining and flickering in the background. So, I really love the shelf. When I'm able to get my new Ariel bag for Christmas, and my husband has it. He hasn't let me open it other than showing you guys in the video. So, I'll have to make a spot for it once I get it at Christmas time. So, that'll be my second favorite shelf is my Ariel shelf. And then, let's move on down. And then, I have here just a couple of popcorn buckets. I have this gorgeous 
a steamboat willy boat uh, from, it's either Hong Kong or Tokyo. I can't remember. I think it might be Tokyo. Um, Beth at the Collectioneers Club sent that to me. And then I have another popcorn bucket here, Steamboat Willie. This is from my sweet friend, Tanya. And then, of course, this is one of the latest little plushes uh, from the Disney store. So I love that shelf. And then coming on down, we have my Vera Bradley, um, Disney Vera Bradley backpack. I just took that to Disney, uh, and I loved it. And then over by it, I have uh, my other little alien popcorn bucket, and I love that. And then the last shelf, I have my Dooney and Burke carry-on bag and I love this bag so much it's beautiful and as you can see it takes up the whole shelf so it's huge so really love that also so as you can see this is my whole new system for storing my bags I have every one of my Dooney and Burke bags I have every one of my lounge fly bags, and I have most of my popcorn buckets, all just in this one area. And then right beside it, I've got my mini ears and my little Minnie Mouse suitcase. And so it has really just been a great storage unit for me. Now again, let me tell you, um, normally I store my bags all in dust bags or a pillowcase or something to protect it. So when you put your bags out like this, you're gonna have to be prepared to dust at least a couple of times a week, maybe once a week, a couple of times a week. If you have pets, you might have to do a little bit more, so that would be my case. And so, but I think for the beauty of it, it is gonna be so worth it. And, oh, I just love it so much. So I can't wait to get my Ariel tote, you know, out for Christmas. And then I'll have to really make a spot for it as well. So um, I just really love it. And y'all, let me tell you about how inexpensive and how easy this was. Like I said, I have these, these two end pieces, which are five shells each. And of course you can adjust them to be any kind of, how many you want, if you want less or whatever. So these units came from Walmart. All of this came from Walmart. This end piece here was only, with change, $35. And so, um, yeah, this was 35. If it wasn't 35, it was right in that ballpark. And of course the other one was just like that. These two middle pieces, um, the cubby hole sections and units. This right here is where it, it divides and it's sitting on top of each other. And so, um, like I said, you get six cubby holes in each unit. Each unit was only $29. So two of those and two of the other shelves, and that's it, that's all it took to put this together. I already had my pin board. I already had the goodies sitting on top. And um, yeah, I think it's turned out really good. And I wanna show you the depth. So the depth of this is only 11 and a half inches. So you can see that it really doesn't take up any force space hardly at all. And so it really has given me more space in the middle of my floor. And um, yeah, and I will, diff I will try to link all of these pieces down below and um, give you the dimensions on them. They come in numerous colors. I know for sure it was black and white. Uh, there could be some other colors involved also. But anyway, this is my, <laughs> this is my storage now for my handbags and my popcorn buckets and some other goodies. And I even have space left over. So I hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, let me know. This has just been hugely requested and I wanted to share it with you. And so we'll talk to you again soon. Bye.